Good morning, my dear students. Today I am taking the class, class three, social studies. From the previous class, I have explained to you about my family. First chapter name is my family. I have given an introduction about the family and types of families. So once again, I advise for you. There are three types of families. nuclear family joint families and single parent family so in nuclear family we see nuclear family is a small family in which only the parents live with their children as are now as in joint family is a big family where father mother grandparents grandmother grand aunt uncles it's a big family it's called joint family single parent family single parent family in which only either of their parent children or which children live or either their parents children live is called single parent children so i have given an introduction and this first part is over second part is roles in the family now i am going to take the third part so in this we we just see the activity class 3 social studies page number 4 activity the family tree it has drawn the family tree have a read about your family tree i have drawn the picture here have a read about this family tree okay so you you write your name here children you your you means you you have to write your name here the siblings and you have a brother or sister you just write it. brothers name or sisters name siblings and your father name and mother name father's grand grandfather or grandmother father's father or father's mother okay and mother grandfather grandmother that means your grandfather or grandmother your mother's father and your mother's mother so have any about this family and do it at home write your name Now, about your brother or sister, their names you just write. If you're not understanding, you take help of your parents. They will help you out to have to write the family tree or to draw a family tree. Okay. So now today, I think you have learned the three types of families: nuclear family, joint family, and single parent family. so every member has in the roles of family every member has it its own role its own responsibility as a role i have discussed it. so they have got it, a responsibilities in the families now the third part family structure how it grows and how it changes in the family okay how the family is growing how the changes is taking place the structure of the family have an idea about the structure of the family so now if you look at your a family tree you will see how family is growing so each family if father or mother has each family has father mother their children etc each family and it grows the families grow bigger why why it changes and why it grows when the new people when the new people become a part of it and the new ones come for example if you are uncle or aunt 
your uncle has got married or if your brother has got married and they will have a child a son so the family structure increases uh, due because of some occasions like uh, marriage and the birth of a child bring changes in the family so in the families family structure changes through some marriages family structure changes the family structure changes through through marriage Engage. What is the meaning of engage? Are you 
porcupine sibling what is the meaning of sibling children of your parents children of your parents a brother or sister children of your parents your brother or sister so cousin who is the pet child of one uncle or aunt your uncle son is your cousin who is the cousin who is the cousin is a pet child of So this words please children learn it and have an idea about this my family about my family structure or my family tree. Have an idea over of the chapter. So from this third part, I have completed the chapter. So revise, read. and go through the chapter thank you my dear children for watching this thank you